everyone, my name is Kyle Nutt. I am a photographer, videographer, and content creator. I'm most known for my creative photography and commercials that I make right here at home. So my brief today for Adobe Stock is to make a 15 second commercial about a household item of my choice. I'll be using Adobe Stock assets to create my commercial and I'll be formatting it vertically for social. And the household item that I chose was a reusable water bottle. So let's go ahead and jump right in and find some stock footage that helps us bring this commercial to life. So I'm scrolling through here. Luckily, there's only about 5 million results for water. Luckily, Adobe Stock has this cool feature where you can find similar. If I zoom in right here, you can kind of see the find similar. Ooh, these are perfect. I think this one is by far my favorite. I love how just bright and up close it is. It looks really nice. Let's go ahead and save that to our library. Now let's try to find a water drop. Maybe slow motion and see what we can find. All right, this one looks incredible. I think this is going to be perfect. We'll save that as well to our library. I just found this really cool clip of a waterfall kind of like zooming out from the top. I think this will look perfect for the video. And we're looking for three beautiful locations of water. So far we have an ocean and a waterfall. The next three scenes will be the problem, AKA three different scenes of water bottle pollution. And for the last segment will be the three scenes that I've already filmed of the reusable water bottle. I might just type in rain and see what we can find for rain. I will say, I love how you can just hold your cursor over a clip and kind of preview it because that literally saves so much time. I think this is the one. I really like this one a lot. Okay, so now let's find our water bottle pollution. I found a heavy polluted lake video that looks great for what we're doing. Now let's search water bottle in the ocean. There's so many good ones to choose from. I think I'm just gonna save a few of these actually. These all look really good. So that should be plenty of stock footage for this commercial. Let's go ahead and hop into Adobe Premiere Pro, which I've actually been using for literally since I got started like 10 years ago. All right, this is actually going to be a vertical video. So when I downloaded my Adobe stock, I made sure to get all 4K resolution. That way I'm able to crop in and not lose too much video quality. So let's go ahead and just drag all of this in Okay, so we have all of our stock footage narrowed down. Let's go ahead and start organizing this a little bit. I know I wanna start the video off with that clip right there. I'm also just gonna move those pollution scenes out of the way and pull up our beautiful water scenes. Maybe rain next, I like that. I think the waterfall scenes should probably play last. So now this next segment is going to be all of our trash. So let me go ahead and move that guy back. And now I just need to pick two of these shots and then it should just end with our water. Now we get to go to the third scene which is the footage that I shot last night. This is our final shot, kind of the resolution to our story where it's don't use the plastic water bottle, use a glass reusable one. So for all of these short fast cuts, I want very distinct loud sound effects to go with them. We can also add motion graphic templates right inside of Premiere Pro using the essential graphics panel, which was an easy and convenient way for me to add text overlays to my commercial. After after a few final touches, here is the final draft. So now that our commercial has been completed, let's go ahead and recap all the steps we took to make this commercial happen. I started with brainstorming different ideas of what I wanted the commercial to be about. Then I browsed through Adobe Stock to find footage that helped bring my commercial to life. Then I drug all my stock footage and the footage that I shot at home into Adobe Premiere Pro to begin the editing process. I made all the cuts necessary for this commercial, added in some ambience and sound effects, and wrapped up this project with a few text overlays and some color correction. So this episode has been so fun to make. I'm super excited that I was able to work with Adobe Stock on their Make It Happen series to create this reusable water bottle commercial. Before you go, make sure to check out my handpicked stock collection at Adobe Stock. Thanks for tuning in.